This has been a week of adversity. I faced a little adversity this week, but a dear friend of mine was faced with a mountain of adversity. Shout out to J.W. Smalls, Moeo, my man. Adversity is defined as difficulties or misfortune along our journey. And adversity can bring us to our knees. It can stop us dead in our tracks and tear us down if we allow it. But the thing about adversity, it shouldn't be unexpected. It's inevitable. Even the scriptures tell us in this world you will have trials. So we know we're gonna face adversity. But the real question is, what do we do with that adversity? Do we allow it to tear us down? Or do we use it to overcome? Over the next three days, I wanna give you three strategies to overcome adversity, to make the most out of the adversity that comes your way. See, adversity can drain our brain, or we can teach our brain, we can train our brain to overcome adversity. That's the key. So I wanna talk about three steps to overcome adversity. Step number one, or strategy number one, I call the next step. And it's the most important step. Strategy number two is to see every adversity as an opportunity. Strategy number three, don't avoid adversity. Attack adversity. Two and three, we'll talk about the next two days. But today, I want to talk to you about step one. Strategy number one, the next step. It's the most important step in overcoming adversity. See, when adversity attacks you and you're just rocked to your foundation, what you really feel like doing is just stopping. But the most important thing you can do is take the next step and keep moving forward. I'm a marathon runner. I've run 52 marathons in my life and I finished every one. There were times when my body told me to stop. There were times when my mind told me to stop. There were times when the weather made me wanna stop. But the one thing that I kept thinking in my mind is take the next step. Never stop moving forward. And that's the same in life. When you're hit with adversity and you just wanna stop, feel sorry for yourself, take the next step. Keep moving. No matter how high the mountain, how steep the climb, take the next step. A few years back, my boys and I climbed some 14,000 foot peaks in Colorado and the air was thin, the climb was steep, and there were times when I just really wanted to stop. There were times when every single step was a struggle, but what I had to keep doing was taking the next step. So when you face adversity, remember step one, the next step. Keep climbing. Moyo, everywhere you go.